Welcome to the Girl Scouts Higher Awards Take Action course. This is a very exciting time as you pursue your higher awards. When preparing for the Girl Scout Higher Awards, the bronze, silver, or gold, it is beneficial to review what a Take Action project is and how it relates to the Girl Scout leadership experience. For this course, we are going to review the Girl Scout leadership experience and the Take Action Key with a clear understanding of why the Take Action Key is so critical. What is the Girl Scout Leadership Experience? Here is a short video that briefly describes the Girl Scout Leadership Experience. Please pause the presentation and copy and paste the link into your browser to view this video. As we saw in the video, the three keys of Girl Scout Leadership are discover, connect, and take action. Discover which allows girls to understand themselves and their values and use their knowledge and skills to explore the world. Connect to what girls care about, inspire girls to act, and to team with others locally and globally. Take action so that girls act to make the world a better place. The three processes by which the Girl Scout Leadership Experience is built on are girl-led, learning by doing, and cooperative learning. Girl-led is where girls play an active part in figuring out the what, where, when, how, and why of their activities. Learning by doing engages girls in continuous cycles of action and reflection that result in deeper understanding of concepts and mastery of skills. Rather than listening to someone tell them what to do and how to do it, girls get in there and do it themselves. They explore their own questions, gain new skills, share ideas, and take time to reflect. Cooperative learning. This is where girls work to together towards shared goals with mutual respect and collaboration. How to have fun with the processes shows us how we use the three processes to develop activities with and for the girls, where the girls are learning new things while still having fun. Please pause the presentation and copy and paste the link shown on this slide into your browser to watch a video that dives a little deeper into the three processes and how to have fun with them. The five outcomes are what girls gain from the Girl Scout leadership experience and the three processes, girl-led, learning by doing, and cooperative learning, are how they gain those outcomes. Every girl achieves the same outcomes no matter how she participates. When girls participate in Girl Scouts, they benefit in five important ways. Girls develop a strong sense of confidence, where girls have confidence in themselves and their abilities and form positive identities. Girls develop positive values, meaning that girls act ethically, honestly and responsibly and show concern for others. Girls are challenge seeking. They take appropriate risks, try things even if they might fail and learn from mistakes. Girls develop healthy relationships. They develop and maintain healthy relationships by communicating their feelings directly and resolving conflicts constructively. And girls develop community problem solving skills. Girls desire to contribute to the world in purposeful and meaningful ways learn how to identify problems in the community, and create action plans to solve them. By using the three keys of leadership, discover, connect, take action, and the three leadership processes, girl-led, learning by doing, cooperative learning, to achieve the five national short-term outcomes, strong sense of self, positive values, challenge seeking, healthy relationships, and communities problem solving, we are able to achieve our long-term outcome which is our Girl Scout mission of building girls of courage, confidence, and character who make the world a better place. Why is this Take Action Key so important? When girls complete a Take Action project, they are actively taking steps to make the world a better place. Why should Girl Scouts embrace Take Action projects? Take Action projects build leadership skills in girls. They impact our brand and funding. When girls do a Take Action project, it helps communities long term and take action projects raise the bar by having outcomes being measurable as well as sustainable. The Take Action Key and its corresponding outcomes get girls motivated and excited about making an impact in their community that can be felt in the long term. Take Action encourages girls to think bigger and to address problems in such a way that they do not reoccur. And perhaps most important, a Girls Take Action project changes the world in a meaningful way. These corresponding outcomes are Girls can identify community needs, 
In order for girls to start working on their award projects, they must first find out what the community is in need of. Girls also learn how to identify the root cause of the issue they choose to address. Girls are resourceful problem solvers. Undoubtedly, there will be roadblocks along the way, which means the girls will need to come up with creative ways to solve the problems that arise. Girls advocate for themselves and others locally and globally. As girls learn about the issues in their communities and work to solve them, they stand up for issues they believe in, influence policy, and identify ways to continue their project goals into the future. Girls educate and inspire others to act. By spreading the word about their experiences, girls educate others about issues that are important to the community and inspire others to act. This approach cannot help but have a positive effect on their communities. And finally, girls feel empowered to make a difference in the world. Girls develop leadership skills and use the knowledge they gain through their experiences to improve their community and the world. There are many benefits to Take Action Projects. Take Action Projects offer an opportunity for the Girl Scout movement to continue to be relevant in our communities. As the community sees how girls are changing the world through the Girl Scout leadership experience, they will want to get involved as volunteers, want to enroll their daughters in Girl Scouting, and want to serve as project advisors on Take Action Projects. This, in turn, will allow for even more Take Action Projects that will change the community and the world. Take Action Projects are more than a service project. In the following slides, we will, we will review and define what a community service project is versus a Take Action in Girl Scouting project. Participants will then have an opportunity to practice transforming projects from a community service project into a Take Action project. Some community service projects address an immediate need in the community. For example, girls organize a book or clothing drive, paint walls to cover up graffiti, or hold a one-time march or fair to highlight a community problem. Although these projects address a need in the community, they do so for only a short period of time. The characteristics of a short-term project include addresses, addresses an immediate need, makes the community better for some people right now, does not include provisions to ensure that the service is long-lasting or continuous. A perfect example of a short-term project would be that an uninsured family's home is destroyed by a fire. A short-term solution is to collect clothing, household goods, and foods for the family. A Take Action project picks up from where a short-term project leaves off. For example, the girls organizing the book or clothing drive could make their project a Take Action project by holding the drive annually and getting a sponsor to advertise and organize it every year. The girls who painted the walls to cover up graffiti can create a club that travels around the city painting beautiful murals on buildings that have been defaced. And the girls who held the march or fair could expand the event to include community artisans and make it an annual gathering. For each project, girls can publicize and get people in the community to come out and support. They can even get community leaders involved. Characteristics of a Take Action project are addresses a need immediate or otherwise, addresses the root cause of the problem, creates lasting impact in the community that can be measured, and it includes provisions to ensure sustainability long after the girl has finished her project. When girls pursue Take Action projects, they take time to identify and understand the root cause of the issue they are addressing. Girls also must make sure that each project is sustainable and that the impact is measurable. So what does this mean? A Take Action project is measurable. The success of the project can be determined based on the number of people the project helped, the number of people who were involved, and reduction in the community's need and other concrete numbers. Take action projects are also sustainable. Girls make arrangements such as collaborating with community leaders and or organizations, building alliances with mentors, to ensure that the project creates lasting change and is not a one-time event. The amount of sustainability of each award increases with each level and is outlined in the award trainings. The following slides contain a community problem and a short-term solution. Practice turning these short-term solutions into long-term take-action projects by pausing the presentation to brainstorm some possibilities. After each short-term solution, there is an example of how to turn it into a long-term solution. Each one is just one example of changing up the solution to make it long-term and more sustainable. Issue number one, an uninsured family's home is destroyed by a fire. Short-term solution, collect clothes, household goods, and foods for the family. How do we make this into a take action project? Pause the presentation to brainstorm a possible long-term take action project.
One possible solution could be to establish a Habitat for Humanity group in the community or work with an existing Habitat group and organize a work group to rebuild the family's home. Issue number two, racial tensions exist in the community. Short-term solution, organize a one-time diversity celebration. How do we make this into a take action project? Pause the presentation to brainstorm a possible long-term take action project. One possible take action project would be to create an organization that holds regular seminars or meetings or workshops about racial tolerance and understanding other cultures. Issue number three, families are going hungry. Short-term solution, hold a food drive for families in need. How do we make this into a take action project? Please pause the presentation to brainstorm a possible long-term take action project. One possible solution could be is to come up with easy to make recipes and a free booklet that include ingredients that items fam that families regularly receive from food pantries. Now that you have an understanding of what a take action project is, you are ready to review the award training that you are looking at pursuing. Please go to the recording on the Girl Scouts Dakota Horizons website for the highest award that you would like to learn more about.